Hi, I'm Bill Martin with Motor Sports Land. Today we're going to take a look at our lineup of StarCraft Autumn Ridge Trailers, what I believe the best mountain built coach in America. A couple of things on the Autumn Ridge we're going to look at. We're going to look at the 315 RKS today, rear kitchen with a slide. A little bit bigger than our normal camping trailer. This might be a great destination trailer if you have a, own a lot up in Strawberry, uh, down south in the mountains, whatever. Maybe this is one where you pull, leave it sit all winter. Uh, bring the whole family, or if you get on to St. George during the winter, something too. So some people don't want a fifth wheel hitch in the back of their truck. Maybe they got a tunnel cover, a uh, camper shell cover, etc., or they want to haul an ATV. This might take a good place of that. As with any of the StarCraft trailers, the first thing we do, and why I believe it's a good mountain coach, is we start from the ground floor up. This coach has got a six-inch I-beam frame. Uh, not a tube channel, not a, not a tent trailer chassis, six inch high beam. And what they do when they build this coach, it's actually a camber chassis. The chassis is actually built like this and then the weight is placed on so it becomes level for the life of the coach. A lot of your manufacturers start with a normal frame and over the years as the trailer gets around, the weight shifts, etc., your walls start to come apart. A camber chassis costs more, but it's the beginning foundation for strength. Another thing they do is they use 15 inch radial tires. A lot of your manufacturers out there use bias. Bias tires do not work in our country. Uh, they wear out quicker, they don't handle the load as well. Make sure you get radials, uh, larger too. Another thing is these axles are already placed on top of the, where the springs are on top of the axles. I've got the ground clearance required for the mountain. Not only just short, but the longer your trailer gets, it's more important we've got some clearance as you go through dips, etc., in the mountains, you're not dragging, uh, hitting stuff. This has got no issues all whatever. So I've got the strong foundation. Another thing that StarCraft does, I've got two by twos on 16 inch centers in the walls, just like your house. Um, stability. These campers are also used, built out of wood framing. They're the only, uh, none of my line, they don't offer aluminum framing. The wood, I believe, is a very strong thing for the mountain country. I can take a two by six of wood and I can actually flex it. Aluminum, I tend, it tends to crinkle or twist. You'll see the big 40 foot, 14,000 pound fifth wheels are typically made with aluminum framing. They're more of a highway coach. This is designed to flex. As this coach stones off the road, down the mountains, it's actually flexing. Imagine taking your house, uh, lifting off its foundation and moving in a 30 minute drive up into the mountains. It's going to, things are gonna fall apart. This is built for the mountains. The coach actually flexes. So two by twos in the wall on 16 inch, two by threes in the floor on 16 inch center joist and a two by four residential style truss roof. They're actually four and a half inch trusses. And what that allows you to do is your air conditioning for the duct is able to go through the ducts. Other manufacturers with a flat roof, they have to cut out sections of the roof. So there's weak spots up there on the roof and you gotta be careful when you walk up there. This also is called the Magnum roof. There's extra supports on it. Any other manufacturer I have, that roof will hold 4,500 pounds in weight. One of the things nobody else does. So the strength and structure is there. As we go down, Easy setup, we'll take a look at a couple things. Power LED lighted awning, comes out a full eight foot. If the weather's inclement, raining, etc., you can still bring your family out here for a campfire, etc. The LED lighting, minimal battery power and really lights up your camp nice. Exterior speakers too, so you can still enjoy the game or something at night. We're bringing all this large size units in with the Arctic package. Your normal insulation is R7 wrapped around. This floor insulation provides R24, R22, and R19 in the walls. So I've got a coach I can take out in February or March. I can take it out October, November during hunting season. Any unit at all, whether you spend under 30 grand or $300,000, once you get below zero, all bets are kind of off. You've got to skirt the unit. This is a coach here though that I would take up in the mountains anytime during hunting season and be happy and comfortable doing it. I've also got the aluminum alloy wheels. At this point here, I really don't want steel wheels. If I'm gonna spend the extra money, I want the aluminum alloy wheels, so no rust. These wheels will last me the rest of the life of the coach. I love them like that. We're gonna take a little walk around the back, the jacks. As with a lot of coaches, sometimes the strength and the structure is not there for the exterior ladder. StarCraft is putting the ladders on the coaches that they need. Uh, this will hold 300 pounds of weight. You don't really need to get up on the roof much, but, but you might want to check around your vent seals, everything, every once in a while to make sure everything's good and dry. 30 foot power cord comes standard. You can hook into everything. Your bumpers, what houses your sewer hop and everything. If you are at an RV park, you've got cable TV hookup. As we go around here, if you can take a look kind of at the front of the slide out there, this is a rack and pinion gear slide. It is not the cheap metal Swintec slide. This is used in heavier units, 14, 15,000 pound units. This is time tested over time. 
Um, probably the only thing you might ever need to do is maybe carry an extra fuse with you. The rack and pinion gear slide seals tight coming in and seals tight going out. Rain, weatherproof. <coughs> All the StarCrafts, <coughs> once again, the height clearance off the road, these my dump valves are extremely high off the road, no risk of dragging them. I've also got black water flush. There was a point in time in some trailers you still have to take a hose inside the trailer to flush out your, your toilet. This is black water flush. Hood a hose on there, high pressure sprays inside your tank, flushes out. Easy cleanup. All my StarCrafts are going to be outside shower, hot and cold running water out here. Whether to clean off, etc. quick, clean off the dog, clean off the kids from the sand, or to clean fish, etc. It's nice to have that unit out there. As we work around to the front, this is a bedroom slide, which we'll get into that a little bit more. Most travel trailers will not have that secondary slide. I've got full pass-through storage all the way through the other unit. Plenty of room for my camp shifts, my lawn chairs, my Dutch ovens. It's also sealed off from the bedroom so that the part under the bed of the storage, uh, extra clothes, uh, dirty laundry, etc., isn't sliding into my area. Most of your manufacturers, when they put diamond plate on a unit, comes up to about here. StarCraft goes the extra mile for you. Once again, a mountain coach. It is designed, and this diamond plate comes way up here, so any spinning rocks, etc., is not damaging and denting your finish on here. Uh, it's just something they do to go the extra mile again. You'll love the easy setup here. If you usually pull into your campsite, it never seems like it's daylight, but I've got a power-lighted tongue jack, and then easy off and on power button, off and on the truck. No cranking, etc., easy off and on. Two big seven gallon, 30 pound tanks will last you an entire year or two if need be, uh, but plenty of propane for the mountains and staying up here in cold weather. StarCraft is added this year as part of their 50th anniversary package. This is a toy lock. This is a steel cable that comes out, wraps around, ATVs, generators, uh, kids' toys, personal belongings that you, you want to leave outside. You can actually lock over the steel cable, keep them away from theft. We're going to go ahead and take a walk inside. One thing you will see as we go through the window here, StarCraft is a manufacturer on my lot that offers a, the buyers a two-year bumper-to-bumper warranty. Uh, peace of mind confidence when you buy from StarCraft. As you go in because of the extra loft, you got to make sure you don't have a double step, but we have a triple step entry, easy step in and out, the large grab bar handle. The first thing you'll notice when you come into the StarCraft 315 RKS is the abundance of space in here. Not only do I have the large deep slide, um, but I've got the rear kitchen. That kind of opens up the area a whole lot mom or dad or anybody just loves the extra counter space, food prep, doing dishes, etc. Uh, 21 inch oversized oven, microwave, incredible size cabinets for doing, I mean, they are deep, you know, virtually 18 inches deep for plates, etc. You'll also get what a lot of manufacturers don't get in a travel trailer, you actually have a pantry also too. And you've got deep pull out drawers, those 38 inch deep drawers, most of the time, you got to open a cabinet door, reach under, just off the seat to get it. Anything you put in here is easy to get to. Once again, another advantage from StarCraft. <coughs> As part of their 50th anniversary package, this is off their 51st year in business, the 8 cubic foot fridge is part of their package. Your normal fridge is a 6 cubic foot. The 8 cubic foot just gives you and your family that much more space for goods to keep you out there for a week. And while you're out there for a week, StarCraft also offers 68 gallons of fresh water. That'll keep you bathing. Uh, doing dishes, uh, whatever you need to do. You can stay out there longer with 68 gallons of water. Another thing StarCraft has done, I've got the big deep double sink. Used to be a farmhouse, but too many customers requested a change. I've got the high-rise faucet, a deep pot in here, uh, separate one for you know shredding vegetables, etc. but a deep dish, just incredible counter space. Your flooring is a new rustic style. This is Conglorium, has a three year warranty on it. It will not crack and peel in cold or hot weather. Designed for RV use, something else that they do. The rear kitchen allows me to be back here cooking dinner. I could have four people eating dinner, two people on the couch, or I could have two people sitting here. So I can virtually have eight to 10 people in here and not interfering with the food prep area. Um, the dinette turns into a bed in case you bring the grandkids over. This is, I believe, this is our trifold sofa. It is an option. I'm glad we ordered in on this unit. But this means if you have the grandkids over or other adults, etc., maybe the son and daughter, you actually have another full-size queen bed for two full adults. Actually amazing what you can do in this unit. And I guess another thing about this, if you do have people over, 
and they're sleeping in your trailer. It's kind of nice that you have your own privacy. And as you look here too, as the entertainment people are in here too, this is a ledge stone fireplace. This does put out heat uh, and it has the glow of the fire. Nice night if you're inside and a 39 inch TV for those nights when you're stamped in here. All built into the unit. Your command center is easy access as you walk into the door. Your slide out control, your awning control, your water pump, your water heater, either gas or electric, we're doing where you're at. All your control panels, your light fixtures, everything, all in one place, out of the way. And a note here for dad, go cut more firewood for dinner tonight. As you look around this year as a brand new, the skylight is an option that we now have. Also LED lighting is part of our package. There's also LED lights under the counter. Uh, that's a nice package to let light in, real important. As we move up towards the bedroom, very wide open shower, nice corner shower, gives you plenty of room. You also have a porcelain toilet at this price point, that's not common. The porcelain toilet, as mom knows, is easier to clean, take care of, no stains, no fuss, no muss. Towel racks are already in place, storage for extra goodies. Another nice thing this has, and I'll go in this way and show you. If you do have people over, your door stays closed, but as you come in here, you also have a private entrance into the bathroom from the bedroom. So it's a walk-through bathroom, nice feature to have. Your normal size residential queen, 60 by 74, already built into it, incredible storage underneath. I virtually have a chest of drawers here where I can keep all types of clothes and goodies and something that most travel trailers do not have because of the bedroom slide out and it's the bed sliding out not the wardrobe I have this massive storage closet here hanging clothes this is in case and as I said earlier a destination trailer in case you get on to St. George for the winter Lake Havasu uh, or just been the mountains for the entire summer you've got place to store clothes up here no matter what time of the year coats etc uh, certainly the 315 RKS StarCraft is, is one of our top sellers because of a destination type trailer as well as a camping. Please come down and take a look at our full line envelope. Thanks for your time today.